So over the years, Woolworths has established themselves as a trusted, and I stress that word, trusted, leader in the food sector, offering customers peace of mind, variety, exceptional quality, obviously, products and the ultimate convenience. They really do make life a lot easier, certainly from a parenting perspective. Now they want to help parents achieve optimal well-being when it comes to their kids by expanding their baby food offering with super convenient meal solutions that are full of the finest, freshest and yummiest ingredients. And here to tell us more are Woolworths product developers, B Atwood and Daddy DeRate. B, Danny, thank you so much for being here. Yeah. Um, there is always a difference. And I know that I have a front row seat. And I, I always talk about the mad scientists that work behind the, the scenes there. But I've actually <laughs> been into these rooms where you cook up these crazy things. And it really does feel like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Um, but there is a difference here. When it comes to baby food, though, that becomes vitally important. It's not just a choice. It's almost like a staple. What is the difference when it comes to Woolies Baby Food? Well, Woolies Baby Food is really made as, it, as you would at home. It's made uh -huh. in a beautiful pot with the freshest, finest ingredients. Farming for the future veg, free range chicken, lamb and beef. Um, no, obviously no sugar, no salt, just as you would at home for the best possible um, meals for your babies. Because this isn't just like a price point buy that we're doing. And we're not just doing this to look good. You're doing this because nothing matters more to us than the health of our child. Exactly. How important is this for parents when they are shopping, this difference? Huge. Um, as, a, as a parent myself, um, we, as you say, literally make it like we would at home. It's farming for the future. It's the best possible ingredients that you're ever, ever going to get. And you can, it's Woolies. It's the trusted Completely. and only the best. And it's not kind of whitewashed flavours. It's the real natural flavours. Yeah. So you're helping to develop their palate as well through that process. Okay, take us through some of the frozen foods. We've got some nice things, that, new things that I haven't seen before that are making me hungry. Yes. Yeah, albeit I am fasting at the moment. So oh, no, <laughs> shit. Um, it is I'll... really delicious. I mean, uh, me as an adult, I eat them. I think they're divine. 100%. Um, so I'm going to speak to you about the fresh and frozen um, stuff, and then Danny's going to speak to you about our long life stuff. So right. our fresh um, range, we can still have our current pouches that we've always had, but now we've got really exciting little tubs um, that have chunky um, textures in them. So we're expanding the textures perfect for the we every stage of the weaning. So we've got smooth, textured and chunky for your child. I mean, how great is this? A little butter chicken for your baby. Uh, um, <laughs> it's obviously got no chili in it, but it's got all the spices. It's super flavorful and it is delicious. And that's a great way because kids struggle with the umami. Exactly. They struggle to take that on board. You only start developing a, a natural enjoyment in your teens for exactly. these sorts of flavors, but they need the food. They need the You've food. Got to get and it's it in so there. like, yeah. it's exciting for them. It's different to your normal like mashed butternut, mashed sweet potato that and it's that mom nice, makes every day. <laughs> there's, and there's also a continuity. So you can start with a flavor profile. Once you know what they like, you can continue on exactly. that journey through the different kind of states of food as well, which helps through that weaning process. Beautiful. And Absolutely then in our frozen it. range, it actually speaks to the, the, the topic you've just spoken on now. We have these amazing little cubes, which allows the mother or parent to be a little bit creative there on their own. So they can have a, a lamb or chicken or, or beef, and then they can mix it with a vegetable, or they can just have one meal. And it, we also have a combo pack where you can buy a whole lot of different um, options to get variety and, and you can mix up. it all together. Ooh. We have breakfast options, fruit options and veggie options, which is really exciting. Stick it in the freezer for lastminute.com. Takes 60 seconds to heat it up and your baby's meal is ready. Thaws out on the way there while you arrive at the picnic, it's ready to chat. <laughs> no, I, I absolutely, I love that. So we've got the, the convenience and the freshness of the fresh food, which is massive. We don't always have the time and kind of the, the life to allow that to happen. So talk me through the long life. So our long life pouches are really exciting. So we've been in the market for a while and what's great about them is that mom on the go, you can literally put it in your bag. You don't need a fridge or a, fri or a deep freeze. Backup or plan number one. Backup yeah. plan for picnics or on the go. But what's really exciting is that we've just launched four brand new plant-based oh, wow. products, which is extremely new to the market. Not only that, um, as you'll know, kids sometimes have allergies, so these products have zero egg, zero dairy, which makes it ready to eat for, for any child, which is incredible. We've got smooth, chunky, textured, and they're just delicious flavors. And with our vegan food, they are high in protein, so we use legumes, chickpeas, to and they just set that balance. Up. Exactly, it's Brilliant. just delicious. Again, it's farming for the future, and 
grateful meat-free Mondays. Oh, completely. Yeah. And it's, I mean, it's an education process. Yeah. You, you think that your child is just getting nutrition, but there is a culture around food. Yeah. And if you can make that culture around healthier food, yeah. it pays dividends. I see it with my six-year-old now, the stuff that he yeah. likes and the stuff that he yeah, doesn't, doesn't like. <laughs> I'm like, what were you doing? <laughs> I sold myself down the river. Um, uh, some, you've mentioned some of the ingredients yeah. going in. Yeah. How, do you have a core kind of thread of ingredients that you put in? Because obviously there's a high nutritional value in certain boxes that need to be ticked. Yeah. What goes in? Um, so basically what goes in most of them is the start of what you'd cook most meals. So onions, carrots, tomatoes, that really brings in the base of flavor. Um, we also use free-range stocks that adds to the delicious flavor in, in the meals. And then we make it as it may, you make it at home. So we add some fruits to the breakfast to add some sweetness to enjoy with the the child as well as nutritional value mm -hmm. and all of our meals have got a large amount of protein co uh, vegetables content with their protein so it's a complete balanced meal in, in each pouch um, and as the parent who often finishes off what the little ones are eating <laughs> uh, I think we're okay we, we can watch the bottom line absolutely love it now I know the links that you guys go to to make sure that the stuff lands properly and as parents I can tell you there is no greater challenge than making sure we get our kids a healthy meal. start or a healthy meal every day and this is a beautiful jumping off points so many varieties so many ways of getting to that end result now it's just about the exciting journey of finding out what your child is going to love the most but you guys have outdone yourself be danny well done time now for you, you. to get shopping sure